Gick on the track. On the track. Today is How Shot Friday. If you don't know, my channel is called Trey with Friends. That's three S's. Um, so pretty much this first video is just going to be me introducing myself, answering the questions that you guys asked on my social media, which I thought was a really, really cool thing to do. Um, I'm sorry, I get super, super nervous and that's part of the reason why my channel will consist more of me with my friends than just me by myself because me by myself is like super, super awkward and then me with my friends is like, I love my friends. <laughs> so yeah, um, can get into it. Okay, so the first question is who are, who am I? Well, like I said, my name is Trey. I'm 25 years old. Um... I'm a cancer. I guess how I would describe myself is really, really bubbly. Uh, yeah, a big ball of sunshine. That's who I am. Um, and y'all will get to know me a little bit more. Um, yeah, that's how I would describe myself for right now before I get all the way in detail and then start answering the questions before I even get there. We not doing that. Um, <laughs> but what do I like to do? See? Um, so what I like to do, I like reading, I like writing music, I like listening to music, anything with music I love doing. Um, I would consider myself like a inspirational hip hop artist or like a motivational hip hop artist mixed with me also. Um, but yeah, I love music, I love reading. Um, my favorite books are like black literature, suspenseful books, I love suspenseful books, um, and any type of black literature, I love it especially when it has to do with like our history and things like that love stuff like that so another thing that i like to do i like painting i love drawing i love hanging out with my uh with my family and my friends they make me like the happiest um, but I, i'm like really really chilled and relaxed so i like relaxing and taking care of myself <laughs> that's things that i like to do um i don't think i missed anything because i do a lot of stuff like i would rather just do it and you know do it and, and fail or succeed at it then not do it and regret doing it so i play like the saxophone when i'm trying to play the saxophone i'm learning swahili i knit time to time when i want to pick up when i want to pick up knitting i am a full-time hairstylist check that out um but i'm a full-time hairstylist i am in school for business and hr management so yeah that is things that I like to do and things that I do <laughs> what to expect on my channel so what to expect on my channel is like I said I'm gonna be with my friends a lot we're gonna talk about like, like mental health um, I'm gonna be making like a lot of vegan meals and vegetarian meals and pescatarian meals cuz I'm a pescatarian um, and I try to incorporate a lot of uh, vegan and vegetarian meals in my diet so I'm really really big on uh, health for those who was already subscribed to Trey and K YouTube channel y'all know those whole shots they not going nowhere we gonna continue to take them whole shots on Friday um, <laughs> but yeah I what to expect on the channel is just full of different topics things that need to be talked about whatever I could do to you know help people and yeah make y'all smile that's what gonna be on my channel um three things that motivate me three things that motivate me i would say is my family um yeah my family god and myself uh because they make me feel the most loved um and i motivate myself because i know i have like a bigger purpose yeah that's what it is i just motivate myself because i, I want to succeed in everything i do so i pretty much motivate myself too and my family they motivate me because i always want to make them proud and want to make my siblings proud so that's number one and um god motivates me because he just filled me with love he make me strong when i be weak so he motivate me a lot <laughs> um when is my next mixtape dropping wow um so i am actually working on an ep right now it's supposed to drop in late march or early april 
around March or April. Until then, stream 1218. Um, who taught me how to cook? So, wow, that's so crazy because man, I was looking up different meals and, and things like that. And um, I was watching like Rachel, Ama, and Tabitha Brown, and I love them. Those are like my two favorite uh, vegan, vegetarian YouTube people that I love watching. Um, but yeah, and I just got a lot of cookbooks. So I always say like YouTube, um, me, Rachel, Ama, Tabitha, um, and all the other people on YouTube that, you know, help with you um, learning about, you know, different diets, especially um, different alkaline foods and things like that. So yeah, what is my favorite meal? So I love pasta. I love Italian food. I would just put that in a hole. I love Italian food, but I hate spaghetti. Mom spaghetti. I don't like spaghetti. Um, my mom used to make like this big old pot of spaghetti when I was little and we had to eat it forever. So I don't like spaghetti for that reason. I love Alfredo. Oh my God, I love Alfredo. It's so good. Um, and I love pizza. So yeah, Italian or Mexican. I love Mexican food. Or Jamaican food. I love Jamaican food too. I love all types of food, honestly. But yeah, Italian is like my go-to. What genre of music do you relate to the most? I would say jazz. Jazz is like my favorite type of music, but the reason why I relate to it so much, cause you never know what you're gonna get with jazz. Like jazz be like everywhere. Like some jazz can be like smooth and then some jazz can be like trap jazz. Speaking of trap jazz, I love Masego. <laughs> Okay, we're not about to get into that. Pinkies up, pinkies up. Um, but yeah, um, jazz. I love jazz, and I feel like that describes me the most because you never know what you're gonna get with me. Like, like sometimes you can get like a hype me where I'm just bouncing off the walls, and then sometimes you get like the chill, laid back, hat to the back type girl. That's yeah. That would just. Yeah, dang, I never thought about it like that. Jazz is definitely my go-to relatable music because it relates so much to me. Like you, like I said, you can get the smooth jazz or you can get the hype jazz where you ready to get into swinging and stuff. Well, not that type of swing though. Wake up, you nasty! Will you make videos of you cooking vegan meals? Yes, I will. And I think I answered that unintentionally, but I will make a lot of videos with me making vegan and vegetarian and pescatarian meals. Um, Cause it's so fun, especially like, you know, getting my friends to try different things. And that's what I'm gonna be doing a lot of times is getting my friends to try a lot of vegan meals because most people, they think all we eat is lettuce. <laughs> like lettuce i've had i've went over people house and they done offered me lettuce like oh she don't eat meat lettuce like no we 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 be spicing some stuff up okay when am i gonna be in your next video i was supposed to be in your first one in my first video is the intro video best friend so you can be in the next video after self-care sunday um my best friend is going to be on my youtube channel her name is naughty naughty p um but yeah she's gonna be on here too and she's a big ball of sunshine just like me um and i love her we've been best friends like forever since middle school almost so we're gonna be talking about friendship and stuff like that and how to maintain a healthy friendship and that's important too so what drives you to be so positive all the time <laughs> Oh my God, I would say being positive all the time is so unrealistic. I'm not positive positive all the time. Um, I have my moments where I do have anxiety, so my thoughts can be dark sometimes. Sometimes I can, you know, think the craziest things. So what keeps me in a positive mind state um, all the time is just knowing that things are gonna be better. I was better than I was yesterday. I was better than I was a year ago, two years ago. You know, I just always try to look at um, anything that I'm feeling like a temporary feeling. And not only do I look at it like that, but I know that I have the right to feel this way. So I express how I feel. Um, I don't stay stuck in that emotion, but I do acknowledge that emotion and I understand like, okay, you have to go through this emotion to feel the good emotion. So it's, it's fine. Um, I guess what, so what motivates me to stay positive most of the time is just knowing that better is always going to come and to know that, you know, 
but it's make people smile, inspire people, be that motivation for them. So that's why I try to like, not all the time, just be a chipper person. Just good to people because you never know what people are going through. Um, so that's what motivates me to be positive majority of the time. <laughs> um, and to keep my thoughts positive, uh, different ways I do that, meditation, prayer. I know how to pray those uh, cynical thoughts right away. <laughs> Hallelujah. Yeah. Just knowing that I'm loved, I'm surrounded by love, I'm always going to be surrounded by love. That's what motivates me the most, regardless of who I'm around. I know I'm loved, regardless. So that's what um, motivates me to be so positive most of the time. <laughs> well, pretty much I answer all your questions. Um, let me know what y'all want to see on this channel. Like, I'm down for ideas. I'm down for collaborations. I know that was one of the questions... I didn't answer but I am down for collaborations um and down to have guests um if y'all have any topics that y'all want to talk about or any questions that y'all have y'all can always drop it down in the comments below so pretty much this is just a chill video to introduce myself and to hey say hey and to give y'all this big ball of sunshine um <laughs> so make sure y'all like comment subscribe and yeah make sure y'all take those whole shots because we got to do that right now Shop Friday. What you drinking? Home Shop Friday. Mm. Home Shop Friday. It's Home Shop Friday. You two a shop.